Hey dude, don't make it bad. Everybody welcome Shire Dude and Cecilia. Share that mic, I'll get this one. Ooh, testing. It works. Hello, I'm Shire. <laughs> Merry Porch Feasts, everyone. Uh, porch, yeah, Porch Feasts. I, uh, I was rolling along last night and I, uh, I, I wrote a poem uh, out of nowhere, it just kind of hit me. So uh, uh, for, the, for the, the sake of you guys so you don't get too confused, the guy in the middle, Tim, here is going to be playing the evil tax man in this poem. Yeah, boo the shit out of him. This is his chance. All right. Uh, so yeah, we all we all have the poem ready to go, guys. Yes, we do. All right, and, and of course I'm also accompanied by Daniel and Cecilyn, uh, and they're all fantastic for joining me. So, without further ado, this poem is called Porch Feasts. <clears throat> Twas the night before porch feasts, and all through the camp, not a single light flickered, not even a lamp. My stomach grumbled as I craved a euro. Campsites were labeled one to four to zero. The volunteers passed out asleep in their beds while colorful lasers danced overhead. And me in my jacket and red mushroom cap laid way to wake, wide awake, too excited to nap. Suddenly I heard loud music boom. I followed the sound to the media room. But who to my spectacled eyes should appear? A man in a tutu with a goatee shaped beard. <laughs> with an uneasy smile and teeth that were glistening, into his mic he said, Thanks for listening. <laughs> then into the room his cult members flew. <laughs> he muted their mics and called them by name. On Daryl, on Garrett, on Robert, on Anne. On Derek, on Mark Edge, Cantwell, you're bad. <laughs> the tax men are here to stir up some trouble. So grab all your cameras and we will burst their bubble. <laughs> Stopping just briefly for a 420 rally, the group went off towards Agora Valley. <laughs> I ran along too to this dangerous place, stopping just thrice to chalk my own face. <laughs> As activists gathered, the taxmen grew nervous. The crowd started chanting, We don't want your service! Where's the victim? Where's the crime? You bureaucrats are wasting your damn time. Instead of all of this, you should have called at 855-450 free. <laughs> Ian passed them a freshly packed bowl. <laughs> Call Free Talk Live. I'll give you control. <laughs> the bureaucrat's eyes welled up with tears. I've been wanting control for years. <laughs> <laughs> then from behind them came a small chuckle. It was Walter Block. And cracking his knuckles, he pulled a large lever. And you might not believe it. The tax men fell into Block's snarlack pit. Before the end of the tax men, re before the tax men reached their end, there's some actions I'd like to defend. Pulling a lever is not a crime. And don't you go accusing that Snarlack of mine. And Walter said, tipping his cap, nope. You can't expect Snarlacks to abide by the nap. Walter Block sauntered away with a grin. The crowd knew better than to argue with him. A sigh of relief was heard throughout camp. Merry porch feast to all, especially those of you who amp. <laughs> Dude, da 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 da